angina pectoris. If an individual is suffering from pain or pressure in the center of the chest, left neck, left arm or shoulder, it is important to take the individual directly to the nearest hospital or call for emergency assistance. Angina pectoris is the temporary discomfort in the chest that occurs if the heart is not receiving enough blood. Take note that an episode of angina is not a heart attack. An individual who is experiencing angina is at high risk for a heart attack. Symptoms of angina pectoris Always bear in mind that angina is basically a symptom, not a condition. The following can indicate an angina. Uncomfortable fullness, pressure or pain in the center of the chest. Pain can radiate through the neck, shoulders and arms. Pain that can range from mild to severe. Other symptoms that can accompany angina include lightheadedness, shortness of breath, sweating or cold skin, fainting, anxiety, pale skin, nausea, feelings of imminent doom. These symptoms are quite similar to a forthcoming heart attack. It can be difficult to distinguish between an angina and a heart attack. The only difference is that angina can last only for a few minutes while the pain in a heart attack does not go away. If an individual is experiencing these symptoms, call for emergency assistance or take him, her directly to the emergency department at the nearest hospital. In case the individual had previous angina attacks, allow him, her to rest and administer sublingual nitroglycerin. After 5 minutes, the angina will be completely relieved. If not, provide another nitroglycerin dose and wait for another 5 minutes. If there is still no relief, call for emergency assistance or go to the nearest hospital. When to seek medical care. If the individual has never experienced the symptoms, call for emergency assistance especially if the individual is uncertain of the symptoms or what action to take. Once the medical team arrives, they are properly trained to recognize angina and treat it quickly and safely. safely.